Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, who blows and poop this is Black Clover here and we are back with yet another episode of Jack and Dexter, the Precursor Legacy. Now, we went into the Forbidden Jungle and we found this gigantic temple that seems like it's powered by Blue Eco and because everything so far about this temple has something to do with Blue Eco. So, we're going to check yes, it out and see what here, is inside. So stuff. far? So it ain't gonna help us. Uh, Daxter just said uh, that that platform back there. Let's, let's go back. So that platform right there, so that blue thing, it's not going to help us unless we are charged with Blue Eco. And so, I'm assuming... Well, actually, I know. But if you guys haven't played this game... You don't know, but it. What we find in here is going to uh, unlock that blue, that blue eco. Uh, what you call it? Uh, jumper thing. Yeah, uh, blue eco well. I keep forgetting those are called blue eco wells. So whatever we find in here is going to find the blue eco well, and I bet that is it. Look at it. It's sparkling with blue eco. There's a precursor orb on top of it. Look at it. I mean, a power cell on top of it. I can't Keep getting those names messed up. The little egg things are precursor orbs. The power cell right up there is the big stuff. There's a hundred of those in this game. And that's what you need to complete the game, are power cells. So let's go grab this good old power cell right here. Booyah! Uh, moonwalk. Moonwalk by Daxter. Alright. And... The blue eco is now open. Blue eco vents have been activated all over the world. I knew there was a way to turn them on. There must be places to turn on the other eco vents as well. Yep. Okay, so now all over the place, blue eco vents are now unclogged or not capped. So we can go pretty much anywhere in this game now. That is why I usually choose to go uh Forbidden jungle first is because you need to go here to unlock a bunch of stuff. So, I'm gonna go over here to this jumper that we weren't able to go to yet. And jump up and get those precursor orbs. Booyah! And now, we shall enter in this room. Let's see what else is gonna happen. Whee! Booyah! Even more precursor orbs. Let's see. Yep. Ran out of uh, juice. Ran out of juice for my blue, blue eco. Uh oh. Aha! So here is this giant plant, and it looks like this is the source for the evil spiky asparagus that haunt the very existence of. Oh my God! No! Oh my God! Of the forbidden jungle. So I th I'm assuming if we kill this guy, all those spike. Oh! Spiky asparagus will die. Ooh, yeah. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Ah! No, what the? Oh my god. Okay. I'm lucky he didn't eat me because he has an attack where he swallows you whole. Oh yeah. It might just be when I have one life left. So if the next time I get hit by this guy. Oh no. Ah. But you really gotta worry about those little babies that he spawned because those guys, they're kind of tough. So. There's gonna be three that come out here this time. Gotta watch out for him to eat me. Oh my god. Oh my god. I almost fell. No! Oh, oh no, I'm eaten and Daxter is splatted on the wall. Perfect. Alright, let's try that again. Let's just do a little bit. Oh no! Oh! Oh! Okay. It's okay. Oh, already got the precursor orbs. That's right. That's right. Ah, uh, you spiked asparagus. So it's actually, that is the tip of his roots. Those are like his roots sticking out all throughout the Forbidden Jungle. So once we defeat this guy... Ooh. Oh, you're dead! What you, oh, oh my god! What are you gonna do about it, son? Eat me? Probably. Oh, oh. Alright. So this is like kind of the first little mini-boss in the game. He's, he poses a challenge. 
He's a formidable opponent, I have to say, especially with those guys. And especially when you're off off your game like that. God, really off my game. Like, this is not good. It might just be because I'm not really con- I'm not- my full concentration isn't on the game. I'm also trying to talk to and uh, commentate as well, but let's see if I could just plow through this going like nobody's business. Nobody's business! Oh my god. Okay. Die, you little demon baby. Ooh, yeah. Watch out for him. Come on, what you gonna do about it, son? Alright, so he's gonna make me hit him. I don't know why he would do that. But, uh, yeah, he allows me to hit him that way. So I'm gonna take that chance to do it. Uh, can't really get cornered in by those guys, or you're in trouble. You are in big doo doo. Alright. Open this up. Eh, eh. Jump! Crazy Jack. Alright. Now there's three that are gonna come out. So I'm gonna start over here. I'm just gonna let them um, come along. Ow. Okay. No. Okay. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Just can't get hit by this guy. Yes. And I think I've defeated him. Booyah! Yeah, so it only takes three hits to kill this guy. Yep, playing the black thumb because I just killed the plant, not made it grow, or I'd be called the green thumb trophy. But um, a little secret here if you didn't know and you want to collect all the precursor orbs, just jump on his head, they'll pop out. Isn't that funny? I just happened to discover that by mistake. I was just jumping all around, you know, in celebration, like, yeah, I defeated him, yeah, what now, what now, and I jumped on his head, and a precursor oil popped out, so I was like, oh, that's how you're supposed to get those. So, yeah, I literally find every single precursor orb besides those. Make sure you get those, because you won't be able to complete the forbidden juggle, which is what I just did, which is pretty sweet. Alright, so, I'm going to look on my map here. Okay, connect the eco beams, which is in progress, and that's the only thing. That's the only thing we have to do. So I'm gonna finish that. Head over here. Oh, perfect! I didn't that see him. Like this is a huge Should problem with the backup? camera right now, and I'm not used to the camera at all. But we were lucky enough to spawn back right here, close to the beam. Actually, let's just fall down right here and connect the beam. The last and final beam, I'm pretty sure. Oh yeah, here we go. So it's supplied from the tower, and it's rerouted throughout the entire forest to up the up the hill to Sandover Village to the mayor's house, which will char which charges the entire Sandover Village practically just on that one window. So that's pretty cool. All right, let's head over to Sandover Village. Woo! Oh yeah, forbidden jungle. All right, let's see here. Here's the yak house. Remember that? Remember that? Yep. Good times. Good times. Okay, let's see what I gotta do in here. Okay, so I only have one, and that's freeing the seven scout flies. I need to get bring 120 orbs to the oracle. And I don't have that yet, because there's two. There's two power cells in the Oracle, and 180 times two is 300, and I don't know, math, gross, I'm on vacation. I don't want to do that. But I know I, actually 120. Oh, so I'm set. Yeah, so let's go over to the Oracle. I didn't see that. I thought it was 180 for some reason. But it is 120, so let's go over. And talk to the good old Oracle, which actually play a huge part, like, um, in the three Jack games. Like, I don't know if people, when this first came out, I'm assuming people just thought, oh, it's just a cool uh, precursor guy. But they play a huge role in the upcoming games. I mean, it's crazy. I don't even know if Naughty Dog knew they were going to make more expansions to the Jack series. Maybe they just made it as a cool guy too, but then... I don't know, it's, it's cool to think about though. Definitely cool to think about. Let's get the other power cells. Yeah, Boom! There's two cell. right away. Which is sweet. Alright, look at Samos. 
There's flies flying. There's birds flying on the wreck. Alright. Now. Oh, and we can use this, the boat because we did finally succeed on the fishing minigame. But, uh. Yeah. Alright, it's been 10 minutes, so I'm gonna end this episode. Thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. Like, favorite, comment, and subscribe. See you guys. camera just has not figured itself out <laughs> like they haven't really perfected the camera system oh my god i am so